Hello everybody, it's Linda and I've got another project to share with you. I have made this uh, lace heart. I have been looking at these wonderful, wonderful uh, hearts using, you know, appliques and lace trims and everything. And, and they always have such beautiful uh, images printed onto fabric and I don't have that. So what I did, I just used my stamp and I stamped onto some cotton fabric. And I just, you see, I had to do it several times before I got an image that I was happy with. And then I just cut out a circle of felt and I glued this using my glue gun actually to the felt. And I just smoothed it down with my finger uh, once I had, you know, put the glue on the felt and this on top. And that made it quite, uh, well, not stiff because that was what I was worried about. I used this burlap and this burlap is a horribly fraying burlap -y kind of fabric. And so what I did, I just made a template and that I do just drawing a heart and cutting. And here you go. And I just cut around. I folded my, my burlap in two placed on the heart and I cut around it. So I got two heart shapes. And then uh, I grabbed uh, this trim here and I just have this small piece left actually. <laughs> and I just glued this down to the one piece of heart or the one heart, one of the heart pieces, sorry, <laughs> all the way around the edge. And uh, then once that was done, I placed the other burlap heart on top of the, the, the one with the trim on it. And I glued around the edge so that it would hold securely until I had glued all the way around up to so. And then I just stuffed the heart um, and I glued it shut here. And that gave me this dimensional heart here. And uh, then I had a like a blank burlap canvas and I just started playing and layering trims and this beautiful trim here with the beads on it. I got from my dear friend Vandana. Thank you so much Vandana. And uh, I used the remains of this trim around the edge of uh, my image. And this is also a piece of trim that I got from Vandana. And this is the Tim Holtz button and I just placed a beautiful flower center in the middle here and I just uh, put some strings of beads and stuff down there and as you can see it's just layers and layers and layers and I glued this down under the bow and I made the bow bows with the bow easy thing and on the back I finished it off using laces and uh, fleur de lis and some appliques, this beautiful applique I got from an eBay seller. And I'll put the link to the eBay seller below because she's got really, really wonderful, wonderful appliques and so affordable. So the rest of the appliques, they're from different uh, Etsy sellers mostly. I, I love shopping for laces on Etsy because they have some wonderful, wonderful sellers there. And they're really affordable too. So that's my quick and easy peasy heart and uh, if just uh, hold on a second I'll just show you uh, here is the stamp with a piece of felt under it and uh, as you can see it's not very stiff at all so you can shape it I wanted the felt backing because this is fraying fabric and um, I just wanted it to you know hold the shape and everything a little bit better and I also wanted it a little bit dimensional so that it wouldn't just melt into the background I just wanted it to pop a little so as you can see it does so yeah I hope you give it a try uh, it was tons of fun to make and really quick and really easy and I think it's a beautiful gift for a friend so yeah have fun everybody and take care and thank you so so much for watching I really appreciate your comments. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.